Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. Today we are going to be doing SIPs lesson number 23. Say train, sound train, t-r-a-n. Say drain, sound drain, d-r-a-n. Say stray, Sound stray, s t r a. Say spray. Sound spray, s p r a. Say grain. Sound grain, g r a n. Good. Say praise, sound praise, p -r -a -s. good. <clears throat> okay, now we're going to be going over some of our sound spellings. We don't have any new ones today, um, but if you noticed a lot of those or all those words that we just went over had um, two new sound spellings that you did yesterday with Mrs. Croissant. So let's review those. Sound. A again. Sound A again. And for those two, you're using this sound spelling card, the cake on it. Sound er again. Sound E again. Sound E again. Sound or again. Sound er again. Sound er again. Sound R again. Okay, so next we are going to go over our reading a mix list. So I am going to point to the word, ask you to think about the word, read it, and I'll have my finger underneath the word. And then when I get to the end, I will read it so you can check your work. Think, read, brave. Think, read, Shot. Think, read, braided. Think, read, short. Think, read, north. Think, read, Lay. Notice I underlined our A-Y and our A-I words because that is what we are really trying to focus on today. Think, read, trapped. Think, read, brain in your head. Think, read, spray. Think, Read, cleaning. I'm gonna fold these in half so maybe it's a little easier. Think, read, waste. Think, read, miles. Oops, I made a mistake. Think, read, clay. Think, read, Air. Think, read, worn. Think, read, say. Think, read, porch. Think, read, jail. 
think, read, squirt. Think, read, tray. Good. Okay, and again, if I'm going too fast, just pause the video or rewind it. That's no big deal at all. All right. So the next thing that we're going to practice is are words with more than one syllable. So look at this word. The first syllable is X, second syllable press together, express. How many syllables? Two. This one, first syllable X, second syllable pecked, Last syllable, ing. Put it all together. Expecting. This word has one, two, three syllables. First syllable, harm. Second syllable, less. Put it together, harmless. That means something's not dangerous. Two syllables, okay. This word is, first syllable is wheel. Second syllable is chair. So both of those are words. And then you put them together, it makes a whole new word. Put it together, wheel, chair. Two syllables. Okay. Last one. First syllable is X. Second syllable is plain. Put it together, explain. Two syllables. So this is really helpful when you're reading because you might know what press is. You might know how to say X, but putting it all together might be a lot. So it's helpful to try to break up a word while you're reading. It'll really, really help you reading. So today, now we're going to do our sight words. We have three new sight words today. Our first new sight word is often. They often read stories. Often read spell. Read, spell. Read. Okay. Okay. Our next sight word is one. Our team won the game. This isn't like the number one, but this is like I won something. If you win something, then you could say, oh, I won the game. Not like the number one. One. Read. Spell. Read. Spell. Read. Good. And our last new sight word is toward. The dog came toward him. Read. Spell. Read. Spell. And read. Good. Let's go over some of our sight words that we already have been practicing. Read. Even. Spell. Read. Read. Change. Spell. Read. Read only. Spell. Read. Read. Should. Spell. Read. Read, ever, spell, read. Read, never, spell, read. Read, ago, spell, read. Read, mind, spell. Read. Read. 
read, kind, spell, read, read, answer, spell, read, read, nothing, spell, read. Read once, spell, read. Read woman, spell, read. Read women, so remember, they look the same. The difference is this has an A, and this has an E. Woman is talking about one person. Women is talking about two or more people. Women. Read. Women. Spell. Read. Good. Okay. So those were our sight words. Now is time for writing. So please grab a pencil or a marker, something to write with, something to write on, and we can get started. So your first word is claim. So I claim that room 11 is the best, or I claim that first grade is the best. So you're kind of saying something, you're trying to make it your own. Claim. Your question should be, which A? I'm going to show you. Claim. Okay. For claim, you should have written C-L-A-I-M. Claim. The next word is pale. Your question again should be which A? <laughs> it's the same one. A little hint. Pale. Like at the beach, you might bring a pail, like a bucket. Or you might have a lunch pail that you would bring to school. Pale. You should have written P-A-I-L for pale. Okay, your next one is glide. And there is a question. Let me grab the other card. I forgot to grab this one. Sorry. I thought I had all of them. So glide. Glide. Your question should be which I it's this one. Glide. Okay. For glide, you should have written G-L-I-D-E. Good. The next word is pay. You have to pay for your groceries when you go to the store. Pay. And the A sound at the end of a word is A Y. So P A. Pay is P A Y. Okay, our next word is won't. Won't you be excited to come back to school? Won't. Won't, and there is an apostrophe somewhere in that word. Won't, won't. Okay, won't is W O N. And I forgot the apostrophe. W O N apostrophe T. Won't. And your next word is most. 
I have gotten to FaceTime with most of you that are in my class. Most. <clears throat> most is M-O-S-T. Most. Okay. Our sentence is, it may rain. Well, probably not. It's pretty sunny today. But our sentence is, it may rain. So it Think about how you're going to start your sentence with what kind of letter. It, it. So it, capital I, lowercase t, may. The sound A in the end of a word is spelled A-Y. So for may, m, mm, a. It's also the name of the month that we're in right now. May, M-A-Y. If we're talking about the month, the M would have to be capital. It may rain. Rain, your question should be, which A? Er, ain. Er, ain. Rain. Okay. Rain is R A. I N and a period should be at the end. All right, Allendale first graders, amazing job. So below this video is your link for the story for you to read, to practice your fluency and just reading in general. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. And again, if I went too fast, just rewatch it. That's no big deal at all. All right, bye.